Because those those two are out of way too aggressive. Yeah, what do you got to say? Range more or uh, read more. Why did the Indominus like kill really the Sydney? Yeah, the storm. We're here to rescue um, people from decaf. Yeah, I heard. Dominance. So who did get left behind on Dino Island? Oscar, you have the list. Remind decaf what we're doing here. He oh, Jimmy Spark is stage four. Oh, dude. You'll stay for the whole stream. You don't need to go to bed. Then you can't let them. Oh, I managed to uh, find that he was to get back to the Yeah, I guess it was feed your daughter to work day or something. Good thing they sent me along to rescue her. They should so do a sword version. I'm not sure which one's safe. Yeah, that'd be a really good idea. Bravo team, this is Alpha Dog. What's your ETA on the visitor center? Like, a different story, so I'm sorry. We're here, where are you? This place is a disaster area. There's no sign of the survivors. Over. Just finishing our sweep. Head into the... Okay, uh... How about that? Is that better? Like Mike Wise? Happy New Year to you. The mic's a little low. Okay. Uh, how about how about now? Is that better? Much better, says British Travels. Well, good evening, Jack. Says Oscar Staten. Yo, dude. Okay, maybe that's a little bit better. Hyper intelligent. Too quiet. Okay, all right. There you go. That should be perfect, right? Is that better? Is the audio better now? Use this introduction of these characters to like sort the audio out. <laughs> <clears throat> Never insult the guy whose job it is to fly you off Dino Island. Um, I use a program called OBS, James. Games in Audible. Okay. Maybe let's try this. You'll have to let me know how I'm through. Maybe if I move the mic closer. Um There you go, how about that? Is that better? <gasps> Look at the dead body. Dun dun dun. Decaf, keep the engine running. Be ready to get us out of here. Roger. And the game up a little bit. Okay, how about that? around here all good now okay all right perfect oscar it's garza it's garza the dinosaurs didn't take him down it looks like he was shot to death that's one big footprint
Man, those are some serious trank He dots. was shot to death, yeah. <laughs> To the death with you, boy. No, it doesn't look like there's anything else. Yeah, there is going to be a uh, Claire Daring prequel like novel British Transfer. down trying to take off. Sounds interesting. Damn, Lenaris. What were you shooting at? Didn't even go for cover. Billy, get up here. He's not in a hurry, is he? <laughs> I don't know what. Sh Get away from me, Ryan David, the Raptor guy. Did you hear about the discovery that real life T Rex might have Valicus. made low rumbling calls? It kind of reminds me of the Jurassic Park T Rex theory you made a few years ago. Hmm. Interesting. Decaf, we're going in. Watch your ass out there. Watch your six. Trust no one. Watch your ass out there. Let me try and sort this mic out a little bit better. There we go. What the hell happened to you guys? It's not my fault. We couldn't see them. It would the novel just be people visiting and no problems? It would need a new idea for the series, but it sounds a little boring, says Lucas William. Come on I think that's going to be us. my prediction for it is it's going to, like, I don't know, have its own little story, like a, you know, extended universe type thing, kind of like this game. You to get back. I got this. I'll see if there's another way around. Or like Trespasser. You know, just something to around, add to the world building. Out of the light. They'll see you. Just for a bit of fun. But that's my prediction. Oh, I didn't do anything. British Tyrannosaur. It is aimed for children, so we have to keep that in mind. I found some security monitors. I can use the security cams to spot them. Talk to me, Yoda. I think it would be a little bit like his Jurassic Park 3 novels. You know, the ones that you continued on with Grant and Eric. I'll get him. See Vargas, it's too dark. Where are you? In the trees? Go yourself! In the trees, but inside the building. What the hell? Yoda, I'm blind out here. Check the monitor. This Can is you see anything. Right side, behind the rock. Are you in the thing. trees? There's no trees in there. Oh crap, this that. Yoda, where's Vargas? Hiding. See if you can get him to move. Whoa, nice shot. Where's my gun? We're under attack. Don't be back. Get away from me, damn it. Oh. <laughs> 
See, this is why I didn't really like this game me. story. It's just too many people shooting other people. Stand down. The true don't are creepy, I agree. Right in the rap, the guy said it in the chat. What the hell happened to him? They remind me of um, I think I said this last stream, but they remind me of um uh like those do you remember those fish enemy from um Stingray? Uh what was the name of it? What were they called? I can't remember now. But yeah, they had these like fish ships that had these like eyes. If you look up Stingray Jerry Anderson, you know, uh fish submarine, you might find it. His gun did just break the steel beam. Uh... What the hell happened to you guys? They're everywhere. Even now, watching But these two ca characters confused for a second when I was playing that. Oscar, I thought like the guy in the beard with Yoda was shooting at his friend. <laughs> Maybe there's something on the tapes. Hang in there, Vargas. Well, there are, they allude to um, See if you can find other instances tapes. happening at Jurassic go. World before the Indominus in the film, like that, because um, if we can find out what Simon Nasrani says, uh, you know, the very existence of this park is predicated on our ability to handle situations like this, huh. yeah, is the direct this quote. Been for a while. <laughs> and, All right. Bravo team couldn't have gotten you know, here that more than 30 basically minutes ago. That, you know, they're, they're Let's see what well we got. Renowned for, like, handling things. Nothing. Nothing going on here. There, see? Hmm. What is that? Don't know. Take a look at this. Yeah, I wonder what it could be. That? I have no idea. I'm guessing those are the hidings. So that woman just ran off with our paycheck. <laughs> Is he being eaten? That's pretty cool. We gotta go. Decaf, get that engine started. We're lifting off. Decaf. Heck, boy. <laughs> Wait, Miller just put in the chat, heck, heck boy, what are you playing here, Jurassic Park? Please, listen to me, whoever you are, you have to take us back to the visitor center. You have no That's idea what you're getting like, into out here. I know where my I way. grew up. I just need you to keep us safe from these really creatures. Oh, really? How am I supposed to do that? Electric fences are down, dinosaurs have free run of the island. None of us are safe here. Do you understand that? This is InGen Rescue Team Alpha trying to reach Dr. Jerry Harding. <laughs> Obviously, the visitor center was compromised. If you're still out there, we're trying to... Dad, if there's a rescue team coming, maybe we should try to leave a trail for them or something. <laughs> Jess, you should have turned that's the, enough. Uh, if we want to keep out of the way of dangerous quicker. predators, I'm going to need to know where we're headed. <laughs> she didn't want them to hear it. Norte. North? To the coast? What for? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. The Gill Men? Is that what those enemies were called in Stingray? You're hurt. Let me help the Gill you. Men. Now help me. We're going to rest here for a minute. If we're stopping, I'll need to make a fire. But yeah, they're like the submarines look like those Trudons. Right. Stay where I can see you. Yeah, I agree. Uh what? Siente the wait. I would uh I'd like to see Is the Trudons in the film do? one day. Stay close. I think they're a really cool design. Really creepy. Would be nice. Back off some, okay? What? What? Nothing. It's a weird looking plant. Hey, don't wander off. 
Hey, Dad. Are these berries edible? Probably not. It's best to steer clear of anything we find out here. Hey, Dad. There are some eggs over here. Any chance they could be dino eggs? Eggs? No. Remember, all the dinosaurs on the island are female? Still, just leave them alone. We have enough problems without an angry mama bird or lizard to deal with. Dad, there are some fresh dino tracks Lucas here. Lucas Williamson, you should do an like arc chickens. stream one day uh, on a fan server. I saw lots of yeah, that might be quite interesting. It's relatively harmless. It's nothing to worry about. I was thinking about. of doing an armor-free uh, Jurassic Park live stream if I can find a server edible? that um, has the mods. That plant is I've poisonous. heard this. Um, a handful of those berries is there. enough to kill a grown man. I do that. They look delicious. That's a really funny Maybe game. Just to play. a couple wouldn't hurt me. Yes. Night, James. Have a good evening. Um, what else can I do here? What did he say here? Figures. Even the berries here are dangerous. I'm so what? Just call them compies. It's easier. Mm. Too close. <laughs> British Tyrannosaurus still misses. Uh, Jerry Harding's porn stash. Are you sure you're okay? That bite looked pretty bad. Normally I work with animals, but I am very well trained in first aid. I, I'd like to go ahead and take a look at your wound again, if you'll let me. <sighs> I'm fine. Look, you're going to need it cleaned and dressed again to avoid infection. If you bring us back to the visitor center, I can get a hold of some antibiotics for you. You, girl. Yeah? Some of these trees have fruits that look like tiny blueberries. Bring some to me. Uh, okay. It's Jess, by the way. What? Uh, Jess. My name's Jess. Okay, Jess. Bring me the berries. They're good medicine. I'm gonna assume there was this plant because there was actually two bushes I could get berries from. Are these the berries from. you're looking for? No, those are poisonous. Oh. Don't break them, and whatever you do, don't eat them. I wonder them. if she says no, depending on which one you go to first. Are these the right berries? No, the ones I need are darker. Are these the berries? Hardcore Jed, yo, dude, see. how are you Bring doing? Welcome to the stream. Just having a bit of a Losing relaxed daylight. evening. Come on, girl. I need those berries. Playing some Here, uh, uh, Jurassic Park the game. Nima. Uh, not much at the moment. Gracias. We had a, a bit of a scrap in the visitor um, center with some Trudon. She's a good kid. And some other humans. I know. And now hmm. we're just fishing for some berries. Um, Don't be stupid. <laughs> Mercenary botany school. <laughs> the way they're just looking at each other. Look, before we go any further, I yeah. want to know why, why you're, you're here, here and what you plan to do with us. You'll be okay if Hi, you do Jed, I nice. I have my red Rex right next to me at the moment. Good man, good man. Um, do you do you have any family? None of your business. I just thought that if you could understand how. You love your daughter, don't you? Oh uh, yes, of course. You'd do anything to make sure she grows up safe. Yeah, I would. Good. 
then I know you'll do exactly as I say. And as long as you do that, I won't shoot her. I can tell by the way you talk to Jess. You, you have a daughter, don't you? He is me. Stop talking. He means business. Think of her. And you'll understand what I I'm saying. Say that, shut up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I. You know nothing about me. We are not simpatico, comprende? You say another word, and I will shoot you and leave you for the scavengers. Please, just calm down. I didn't mean anything by it. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I won't mention it again. Please. Hey, um, I, I drank like four diet sodas earlier, and I really have to pee, like, super bad. Go. Hurry. Oldest trick in the book. <laughs> Yeah, they should have um, written that into the script, Lucas. He brought his daughter to the dinosaur the island the and sure he cares that much about her safety. Okay, can you describe your location? Any <laughs> yeah. buildings, roads, landmarks? Uh, landmarks. Uh, I mean, he didn't. No, not really, if he's meant to be related to Sarah like Harding, he didn't stuff. tell his paleontologist daughter oh, about the my island. My dad built a fire. You might be able to see the smoke. If Yo, what do you think you're doing? Um, I'm just calling my boyfriend. It's stupid. Please, this is my fault. I don't want to kill you, but I will do it in a heartbeat if I have to comprend. Eh? What I have to lose is too important. Let's go. We're getting out of here. Oh, I, my dad built a fire. You might be able to see the smoke. Hello? What happened? Is that them? Was that the Hardings? Yeah, it was the girl. It didn't sound good down there. Girls said they were headed north. Let's head that way and see what we can find. I don't know, Yoder. Maybe that girl was in shock, you know? I read a study hey, once that said... Do me a favor and stop talking. Just head north. Hang on to your butt. What the hell has everyone been? Asks Hardcore Jed besides joking Oscar? around about Oops. suicide. How's like that, that one exactly? idiot did two days ago. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> he done goofed. No sign of them there. girl say anything to you about a cliff? No, but she did say they were going north. They could have been heading for the coast. No sign of them, just trees. We got smoke. Trying to I'm interested to know if, like, I, if I'd pick that one first, would they have just gone straight to the What was that? First, headed this way. Or the chopper? Why the hell would they do that? Hang on. Pretty cool. The way it keeps itself off the um, helicopter. Finally. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to take over for a while. Oh, did I fail? Finally. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to take over for a while. I just find that character so obnoxious and annoying. The like main engine guy. Thank you for choosing Yoda Airways. Yoda. 
Yoda is just such an annoying character. Oh man. It does look a little bit like the, the um, Robert Muldoon yeah, action should have gotten pterodactyl insurance. Tyranodon insurance. Huh? Can you fix it? Uh, yeah. Give me about a month. You got an hour. There's duct tape in the survival kit. These jungles seem different. Different from what? All jungles kind of look the same to me. I just don't think they would actually have those pteranodons on Isla Nublar. I mentioned this at the start, like, those pteranodons were highly aggressive in Jurassic Park 3 and they had them caged. And it looked like, looked like they had them caged for a reason. And then to see them in this game just flying around Isla Nublar is just a bit like, Check it out. Close. Come on. Hold up. It may not be safe. I know. That's what I have this for. British Tyrannosaur says Yoda gets better once he starts getting serious. At least that's my opinion. Yeah. Oscar, definitely signs a camp. The subjects were here. I think it's a little bit like the, the voice actor and the general look of the character. He's just a bit of a douche. <laughs> no broken leaves, stems. If they came this way, they didn't leave a trace. I got some blood here. This just keeps getting better. Alex Silakio, why, why the fuck did he run like that? I've always died at that part. Died laughing. <laughs> sign of a trail. No broken leaves, nothing. We've got some fresh tracks here, Oscar. I'm guessing dinos. I can't comment on that, Hardcore Jed. Not at this time. Oh boy. I'll bet that's not going to go over well with Mom. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> that was pretty cool. that combination. You okay? Oscar, thank God. I thought I was a goner. I told you to be careful. What the hell is that thing anyway? Whatever it is, I'm gonna kill it. Whoa, whoa, calm down, big guy. It's over. It's over. Let it go. Look at it. You won. It's not gonna hurt anyone now. Hey, thanks. Anyway, I looked everywhere. Couldn't find any sign of a trail. Hmm. That way. I mean, I'll give it to the game. It makes you feel for the dinosaurs. You realize we're headed straight towards a cliff, don't you? There's no way down from here. We're gonna have to find another way around, which will take us, I don't know, at Make least it half the day. There's an old yeah. boat path that will take us down. Oh my god, we're at the uh, roller coaster scene already? I didn't realize what this was in chapter two. Oh wow, how are you going tell me about any rides like this, Dad? Well, none of the rides are ready for the public. I, I didn't want to get your hopes up. That path was ancient, carved into the stone. It survived storms, earthquakes. Look, it's it's too late to go around, and it's too dangerous to go back the way we came. 
Just use the radio. Contact the rescue team. It is our best chance of survival. Down there. We can ride this contraption to that get us down to that exit. Uh, really cool. We're gonna ride it? That lever. It looks like it would set the tracks to stop at that exit. Yes, but that's the emergency lever. Besides, it's obviously not ready for people to use. Well, it looks like the only way. You find us a safe way down, or I'll throw you down. If I can get the power on, I might be able to set the, the ride to maintenance mode from up here. What's maintenance mode? It'll switch the tracks, same as the emergency lever. Basically, it lets the employees use the tracks for work and repairs instead of for fun. But I don't see any Yeah, I think the ride at. looks a little bit naff, but the, um, still going? the bone yeah, shaker it's getting dark. looks really we cool. Go and back the, the poster came, in the background for the sounds ride like the dinosaurs awesome. are getting ready to hunt. Are they hunting us? Well, they're still a good ways off, but we shouldn't stick around here for long. Listen, if we're going to make it to the coast, we're going to have to work together to make it there alive. Understood? You, come with me. We're going to get some cars on the track. <laughs> yeah, Lucas, contraption. Has she never yeah. seen a roller Stand coaster before? Yeah. You're going to help me get the cars on the track. Yeah, she calls it a contraption. Hey, Dad, what are these cars for? A rare seats. yeah. My guess is those are utility carts. We got to get them off the track yeah, I think and it's load a little them to bit cars boring. we can actually sit in. Not to be too harsh. <laughs> um, I think it's a little bit boring to have the, you know, carts the same colour as the tour vehicles. Because they could actually, if, you know, put on sort of a different colour scheme. Do something new and unique. Move the scaffolding. How am I supposed to do that? It's like way too heavy. Let's go. We need that scaffolding off the track. Yeah, uh, I don't think it's going anywhere unless you're way stronger than you look. Just push it. I can't. You push it. No way I'm moving it by hand. Oh, I see. Judging by the layout of this place, I'd say the power station must be over in that area. Stay there. You go. Okay, I think so the Herrerasaurus like, was on the power station. Look for was doors. on the original park brochure in the film. Hmm. Nothing here. Come on, we have to look at this one. Yeah, that's great. Because Jurassic Park is all about safety. Dad, I found doors! Is this the power thingy? That looks like it. Open them up and throw the main switch. Yeah, I love that he's just letting his daughter do the most dangerous thing. The doors are locked! Well... I don't have a key. That's cool. I'll just bust the windows. This should get me into those doors. Oh. Shoot. She should have said shit then. Shit. Shit, I didn't hit my mark. This should get me into those doors. Oh, what? Oh, I hate Shoot. these. This is like when you're cutting down the bushes. Uh... This should get me into those doors. Oh, 
Come on. Shoot. This should get me into those doors. Okay, so no. Shoot. <laughs> oh no! Don't try the doors again. Oh, I need something to break them with. Yeah, Jess is a little bit annoying. This should get me into those doors. I've got to wait till it flashes. Oh my god. Uh, I need something <laughs> to break them with. This is taking way too long. Alright, alright, this time. Wait till it flashes. This should get me into those doors. There you go. Okay, I, I can reach inside, yeah, I do. but what are Literally. they looking for? Jess, there are two large switches inside, but you probably won't be able to reach them like that. Jess, over here. Okay, I'm coming. Move the crane to the shed. Okay. Hey, looks like the crane is functional. Good. Now do something useful with it. Yes, be careful. What are you doing with that hook? I've got a plan. You're gonna love this. Okay, Dad, your turn. Everyone get back. Awesome. Okay, nice little throw back to the one. switch there. <laughs> Hardcore Jen says next time Jess gets attacked by a dinosaur, let her die. <laughs> Welcome to the bone shaker. <laughs> Looks like we have power. Oh, cool. Okay, come on back. There is no way in a million years you would What's ever that? get me to go on to a uh, They're still too far away for me to tell which ones that was like half finished. Not a T-Rex though, right? Definitely not a T-Rex. Okay, what are we looking at then? Two, three, four, yeah. Um. 
Okay, these, these are the main controls for the roller coaster. I should be able to set it to maintenance mode from here. So, to get the ride started, we need three cars on the loading track in the right order. You stay there. Your daughter and I will get the cars back on the rails. The ride won't start until all three cars have been put on the track correctly. It's a safety measure. The ride won't start until all three cars have been put on the track correctly. Mean to it's press a safety repeat. measure. Well, that ought to do it. The ride should stop and let us out at the maintenance exit instead of doing the normal loop. Come here. Then how do you get the car to move? Oh, you need the crane. Of course. Of course. Of course. track but what if we damage the track then there's no way down we could do something with this right how about hooking it there no good won't reach macho metal hello jack good to see you again yo dude glad you're back to the scaffolding. We could do something with this, right? Attach it to the scaffolding. We can use the crane to lift it off the tracks. Stand Cheers back, for the Jess. heads up, British Trinosaur. Yeah, I would have shimmied across the track by hand. As Alex is saying. So, uh... I can't fit any more cars in the track. I'll have to move some off first. Actually, <laughs> there's no open slot to move the car into.
Okay, right. Let's see if this works. Uh, I can't fit any more cars on the track. I'll have to move some off first. Okay. What are you guys saying? Uh, watch the playthrough. Watch the playthrough of the game recently, so stuff is still fresh. Oh, that's good to know. Cheers, man. Trauma child, long time no see. Yo, dude. Alex says, okay, Jack. Now it does look a little weird, I'll let you know. Yeah, yeah, I can. I can see what I've got to do. It's relatively simple. It's just. Oh, wrong button. It's just finding the right button. Damien Gaming, hello, Yodi. <laughs> Yeah. Oh shit. Okay, so now I just need to spin that one round twice. Yeah, pretty much that is. There's no open slot to move the car into. Nubla is going down. Going down. I think that's right. Hey, the cars are all on the loading track. Now it's up to you. What are you gonna do if the rescue team shows up? What? I mean, they probably heard that noise. Let's not worry about the rescue team right now. Some people I'd like to see on the end of that hook, starting with John Hammond and the rest of InGen. <laughs> we could do something with this, right? Nope. Leave it for now. Maybe we'll need it later. That's it. Since the ride is in maintenance mode, it should be safe. It won't go very fast. There we go. Come Finally on. got it. The sooner we get to the coast, the sooner this will all be over. Hang on. This is going to be a short trip. Well, there you go, guys. <laughs> Yo, Jurassic Raptor. <laughs> you guys wanted to see uh, Jess die. That's what just happened. That's a dark ending. I got it, I got it. 
Hit him right across the face. Okay. Clever in this game, you know, gotcha. quite a nice nod to the other Jurassic Park. You know, a lot of people forget that the Jurassic Park films don't necessarily have the characters in danger from um, dinosaurs, you. but they actually have, you know, the scene where the car is trapped in the tree and like, chases you. them down the side of the trunk, and Timmy on the electric fence and the power, and then in the Lost World you have like Sarah. Oh, no. Hanging off the side now, of the cliff, like we go for in ride. danger of the Please glass cracking. Don't say ride. It's nice to have a little scene in this game where, like, one of the characters is hanging off a ride, you know. So what did you call those in things danger that were of chasing? Falling. Harry Sorus. Nice little homage Harry to that kind of thing. From the Triassic era. Hang now on to something. Them, we can easily classify them as early theropod. Oh yeah, early theropod. What That's exactly saying? what I've been saying all these years, right, Oscar? Where's Danny? Where have I been? I've been busy working, trauma child. Decaf. Busy, busy, busy. You take the chopper. With I'll stuff check I can't talk about. <laughs> Stay put. Mall Santa. Uh, not quite. But I do kind of feel like a Santa Claus. <laughs> Hopefully, she should bring some joy to you guys soon. Boy, your pilot's a real slob. Keep your mouth shut. Don't even think about it. Dandies. Just staring at some blood on a rock. Oscar! 
pilot's gone. I don't like what's going on here, man. Decaf's gun's jammed, there's a blood trail over there, and he never leaves his helmet on the ground. Never. Decaf is MIA. MIA. MIA? No way, man. He was supposed to stay with the chopper. He's gotta be around here somewhere. Billy, you feel that? We've already lost Bravo team and and and, and Billy! Look, we are not leaving without decaf. I mean, we agreed, right? Oh man, I will not let you turn this into Nicaragua all over again. At least! We've got a situation here. Uh-oh. It's the T-Rex. Inside the chopper. Now. Run! Run! I like Owen running down the uh, hillside in the Fallen Kingdom Oscar, trailer. I've got no power! I'm on it. I don't like when that happens. Pick up the pace. Try it now. That battery's not responding. Try another one. Look, we gotta get out of here. Now. I know. I'm working on it. Yeah, Lucas says, well, who pulls a battery out that slow when a T-Rex is chasing you? <laughs> yeah, the original ending of the first Jurassic so Park was a T-Rex chasing the helicopter. Then we get the hell out of here. Something I've always wanted decaf? to see in the film. Egypticus says, it's a shame like how this T-Rex looks more faithful than the newer ones for the movie. Why don't you tell her what your tattoos that I totally what don't do agree mean? with. <laughs> Gravestones are for the, the one in this game does not him. look that accurate. The skulls are for the people who died because of him. Tell us, where are you gonna put decaf tombstone? You running out of room. What did you say? Hey, come on. It's been a long day and everyone's just a little tense. Let's keep it together, guys. I'm not afraid of you two. Me? Yeah, well, I'm more of a lover than a fighter. But Oscar... You know, I've seen Oscar knock out someone's teeth for a lot less. When I say teeth, I mean face. <laughs> Don't be fooled. You're in the company of Damien killers. Gaming asks, no are you excited you for the Fallen jungle. Kingdom? Oof, 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 oof. Oh, that's got a nice ring you to it. No idea, yeah, man. You have no idea, You have no idea. You're in the company of Martin killers. Rossi, now they need to add yeah. the boat scene with the T-Rex and all is done. Crazy. Yeah. This is what they do. <laughs> They hurt people, and then they oh, no, don't get me wrong, I think the design of the T-Rex in this game looks great. I just don't think it looks 
as good or as close to the original Rex as the ones that are seen in Jurassic World and the trailer for Fallen Kingdom. Hey, I never joke about my job. Besides, Oscar's the funny one. Hmm. Pay attention! This is how men act when they lack the courage to face themselves. No, I like to look at myself. I mean, check out this gorgeous face. Who wouldn't? This is why I didn't like this character. He's just so obnoxious and crappy. Enough. Oh boy. What are you gonna do? Kill me? You did that to me once already. You're crazy! I'm thinking of getting a butterfly tattoo. On my I'm ankle. gonna carve the names of the people you killed into those skulls of yours. Riot. Then we'll see hey. how proud you Listen, are. Listen, there's still more people who need our help. Whatever your issues are, you can work them out when we get to the mainland. And no, you cannot get a tattoo. Yeah, I agree, British Tyrannosaurus. It's, it's just older. Been for a lot. Dr. Harding. Oh, thank goodness you're safe. After we lost contact, and, uh, I was worried something you know, had happened to you. She looked thinner in we Jurassic World because a day, she'd Dr. been fed Sorkin. goats I'll bet. in a the tiny paddock, all over the getting park. barely Dinosaurs any exercise for so long. Bring the kids, fun for all. In Fallen Kingdom, hey, she's looking... don't worry, kid. We're fairly <gasps> geographically cut off from the rest well of the fed. island out here. Just Nothing like she used to be. Nothing but herbivores around these parts. What's going on here? There were some complications. Who are you? Pleased to meet you, Dr. Sorkin. InGen hired us to get everyone off this island. I'm Billy Yoder, and this is... Look, let's just get this out of the way. I'm not yeah. going anywhere. This part Lucas of the William island let is pretty get remote the tattoo. and is a long way from the predators. I'm perfectly safe, and she I don't survived, need saving. Yeah, the old roller coaster. That's not a good idea, ma'am. But, since you're here... What you can do is start loading the stacks of bureaucratic in-gen paperwork Alex, that's taking up valuable space. Alex, my most disliked character in the game. Go on, who months do you ago. dislike most? Listen, lady, we don't have time for Billy this. Oda. You either get in the helicopter <laughs> peacefully, or I will personally knock you out, put you in cuffs, and throw you in. You lay one hand on me, and I will have Dr. you Sorkin. so ass deep mm. in litigation that you'll be reading legal text for a decade. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know what? If it'll help us get off this island faster, we'll move your boxes. Where are they? Over there, at the loading dock. You heard the lady. Hey, can I help? Sorry, hon. This no. ain't a job for little girls. No. Look how skinny you are, anyhow. Don't you drink milk? Oh, I Why do you, you hate Sorkin, Alex? Team. I What's wrong with Dr. Sorkin? <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Cool We're King highly Sorkin. trained soldiers for hire here. We're loading this stuff up as a courtesy. Do they teach you to lift with your legs in mercenary school? Or do you bring a dolly with you on rescue missions? <laughs> ah, you're a smart-ass kid, aren't you? I also like football and hate shopping, but I still can't find a boyfriend. <laughs> body, body shaming. Are you serious? What? I'm taking a break. Good idea. Don't want you to strain yourself. So what's the deal? Why didn't you tell Dr. Sorkin why it's so important to get off this island? Trust me. If we bully that one, she's gonna cause problems. So what do we do? Simple. Charm her. Look, all I need to do is get some information on this woman. Dig into her past. Find out what makes her tick. I'm sure if I say enough of the right things... She'll practically think getting off the island was her idea in the first place. Hey, can I bum one of those? Okay. <laughs> I like that. I like the Ugh, Jess asks like for a, a cigarette. That's funny. Dog hair. I know, right? I don't get why dinosaurs what? eat that stuff. Talking over no. woo. No Who way, feels man. Like carrying these boxes back to no the helicopter? way. Woo's the best. Me neither. I'm not moving these things. They look like they weigh a ton. I think Dr. Sorkin said we're only supposed to move file boxes. Oh, yeah. Well, good. How the 
hell does Dr. Sorkin think we're gonna load all this crap into the chopper? Don't know, but you better do it if you want to get on a good side. Okay, well, thanks. You've been a great help. Are you gonna do any work around here? What, are we union now? <laughs> hey, Oscar, was there any dirt on Dr. Sorkin in the mission briefing? If I'm gonna have to use the old Yoder charm, I'll need some intel. Big time protester in the 70s, lots of animal rights crap. Handful of arrests for it. All of her engine related history is classified. Said to expect her to be a pain in the ass. It said that? Between the lines. If you wanna tag along with us, that's cool. Just give Oscar his space. He doesn't do very good with kids, or adults, or animals. Come to think of it, he doesn't do very good with anybody. Out. Yeah, of course yeah, he is. Stay out of his way. You notice how Wu had to look, had to look up that there was a uh, raptor babies in the first movie. What, what do you mean by that? So, Sorkin, hippie type, got arrested a bunch protesting for animal rights. Yes, he did. Yes, that's it. In the first movie, he has to look up and be like, uh, Velociraptor. So, yeah, so he's okay. more, um, hippie type got arrested a bunch protesting for animal rights in his early in his early days so, there. Sorkin, hippie type got arrested a bunch protesting for animal rights. Lucas Williams says, I want to play a Jurassic Park game where you play as Wu and make super dinosaurs and laugh as people try to control them. Yeah. How do I... Ah, oh, there we go. Right, okay. So now I can switch. Yeah. Wait here. I'm gonna go talk to Sorkin. Uh, what should I do? You wanna help? See if you can dig up anything uh, interesting from our friend Dr. Dr. Sorkin in those file boxes. Cool. I can't tell you how many times I tried convincing him. The park should be a nature preserve. No theme park attractions, no cages. Hammond never really cared about the marvels I created for him. It's always been about the money. Gonna about go talking to Sorkin. Well, like I mentioned before, fever, <laughs> swelling at the wound. Her eyes were jittery. You know, Doc, I saw some bites like that at one of my men back at the visitor center. Mr. Call me Billy. Mr. Yoder, would you please tend to the InGen files like we discussed? Yes, ma'am. I hate to interrupt, ma'am, but I really think we need to be going. I'm afraid I can't, Mr. Yoder. Someone needs to tend to the dinosaurs during this disaster. I'm sorry, Dr. Sorkin, but InGen wants all survivors back on the mainland as soon as possible. No exceptions. Why can't it wait? Look, Dr. Sorkin, we already caught one unauthorized trespasser. Who knows who else is on the island? Your life may be in danger. I'll take my chances, thank you. Someone needs to speak to the board about protecting these dinosaurs. You believe in animal rights, don't you? Wouldn't you Protect put your the neck on the line for them? Huh. You have a point. But as long as John Hammond is in charge, the animals are going to need me here to ensure that they're treated with respect. Listen, Hammond really made a mess of this place. You have no idea. There's no hiding his incompetence after this disaster. Well, obviously that's true. If only the board had listened to my proposals. Instead, they just contribute to the paperwork and the file boxes you guys are loading. Is there anything I can say to convince you to come with us? If there is, you haven't said it yet. Right. <laughs> Isn't that the game? Why have I never seen this? I thought I knew every dino on this island. I wonder what the outside world's gonna think of all this. The government of Costa Rica will certainly have to think twice about InGen's presence here. I'm curious too. So, what'd you find out? Looks like Dr. Sorkin wanted to turn this place into a dinosaur preserve instead of an amusement park. And InGen didn't go for it, huh? Why would they? Grassy Raptor no says, ahead of its time, this game so was protecting the dinosaurs as a theme of Fallen life. Kingdom. Good to know. Yes, it is. British Tyrannosaur wouldn't go that far. He hesitates on the name of the dinosaur once. As far as we know, the Indominus escape was not his intention. 
No, I don't think it was his intention at all. I think the what was inside the Indominus completely was, though. Oh, wrong button. So, Sorkin. Hippie time. Got arrested a bunch protesting for animal rights. I mean, I knew <laughs> loading the no file box is taking ages. Someone should have seen this coming, <laughs> but you're angry and scared. Hey, you know who our prisoner is? Because no one else seems to. Well, I've never seen her on the island before. I don't recognize her as someone who works for InGen. But I don't know everyone, so it's possible. Hey, Doc, you got a pharmacy inside? It's going to be a long flight back if we don't get this prisoner either elated or sedated. She seems harmless enough now, and she's adequately secured. Are you afraid she's going to beat you up? Well, I do have a history of women wanting to get their hands on me. Cookie bastard. Hammond decide. What about our patient? I'm fine. I tried to convince her to go with the rescue team, but she refused. Oh, I can't say I blame her, but still, you're lucky you weren't eaten alive. She knows the island. Dr. Sorkin. As I told you, I'm staying behind to watch after the animals. I'm sorry, but we really need to get you out of here. Why? Trust me, there is a very good reason. Well, come back when you think of one. So how did you know to treat her with a tranquilizer? Fortunately, this isn't the first time I've encountered this. The toxins are derived from the bacteria in its bite. Dr. Sorkin, why do you think interrupting me is going to work this time? Wouldn't this place be better off as some kind of dinosaur preserve? I mean... It's kind of stupid to treat these creatures like they're in some kind of circus, right? You're absolutely right, Mr. Yoder. But none of this matters if the board of directors... I'm not supposed to say this, but I heard the board is going to hold an emergency meeting about, you know, new leadership. If you were there, you could act as a witness to the events that took place here. They'd have to listen to you. That's true. I hate to admit it, Mr. Yoder. But perhaps you're right. And our orders also mention an assistant? David. Yes. Oh, here we go. Finally, I got her convinced. Done enough us. talking with he Sorkin. Told him to stay away from the court. Oh, Doctor Sorkin, I'm, I'm so sorry. Thank you. Now, before we go, I have some. It was his intention to work with the military. Wu was corrupted by military Dr. money. Harding, yes, he was. You and your daughter would like to assist but he, he's not. I've been I think he's also corrupted by his hubris more than money. Disorders. Oh, which one? It's dietary. Right up your alley. He just goes wherever he's gonna, you know, get the chance to. Dr. Hardy, to we've work. done it. And what exactly have we done? Reverse the lysine contingency, of course. Wait, what's that? InGen, Henry Wu, added a gene to the dinosaurs that makes them dependent on supplements of an amino acid called lysine. Without their weekly doses, they'll all die off. You cannot give that to the dinosaurs, they need to be contained. If any of them get off the island... Okay, listen. I've been working with the Parasaur's behavioral program for months now. If I go back to the mainland to fight for this place, they'll all be dead before I can get back, along with all of my research. Parasaurs? Parasaurolophus. They're herbivores, generally say. Let me give the solution to them, to see if it even works. How many are we talking about? Why don't you come out with me? See how much progress we've made with them. Can we, Dad? Fine. We'll go. Cool. I'm glad to finally have you out here, Dr. Harding. It's quite a long Despite chat the for circumstances, this. We've been doing some very interesting work with our parasaurs. Behavioral communication experiments. You've interpreted their calls. Some of them. And I plan to use that to get them out of the pen. Out? Well, I'm not going to treat their water with them still in there. How do we know there are British any bad dinosaurs says we don't know around. if it was money. All we know is that the deal there was a deal with Hoskins. Considering what we know of his character, he's corrupted by creation more than anything. Yeah, I agree with that. Without the Lysine contingency reversal in this game being canon, 
the dinosaurs that survived until J Jurassic World makes no sense. No, you have to remember that this game is set a day after the events of Jurassic Park. Now, Hammond in The Lost World says they're going to the island to find out how the dinosaurs are surviving. And that's why Sarah makes the discovery of the lysine in the plants. So, it's not a not saying that the lysine contingency has been reversed. It's, this is just set in a time when they hadn't worked out what it was. Trust me, sweetie. If there were any predators, we'd know. See that one? She's the lookout. She'll stand guard while the others graze. If there were any predators in the vicinity, she'd be nervous and emitting a danger call. But she's not. She's calm. Jerry, you can activate the speakers from there. Jess and I will set the various parasaur sounds that play through them. Dad, it's okay. I mean, it's safe, right? The parasaurs will warn us of trouble before it gets close. Stay with Dr. Sorkin. You can really speak dinosaur? We've been doing behavioral tests using various parasaur calls, playing them through the speakers around the pen. We can't just shoo the animals out, but we should be able to manipulate them into moving using their own sounds. Cool. These speakers on the west side of it's the pen can be set stated to play for a no, but food call that the, will the way the dinosaurs dinos. survive on sauna the speakers on the can just be applied to the mating sounds that will attract the more That's the way I've always taken amorous it. dinosaur. What about the big set of speakers in the middle of the pen? Ah, those emit the danger call. Bottoms the dinosaurs up, yes. will instinctively move away from it. Is. So basically, we can herd the dinosaurs out of this pen using mm. the speakers and their sounds. I hope everyone's enjoying the stream. Um, it's a bit of a chilled out one, as I've mentioned. Something relaxing, not strenuous. Okay. How do I turn on the speakers? I'll have to tell your dad to do it when we're ready. Dr. Harding? Yeah? West side speakers, please. <laughs> little paddock looks a little bit small for these four giant so dinosaurs. So I heard you were like a hippie protester or something in the I don't the think they would be as relaxed Where to listen to that? sounds and stuff. Hey, be convinced the 70s that were a tumultuous time. I guess they're I like cows, what I believed in. Probably. And sometimes it gets you arrested. You were arrested? And you still got a job as a, you know, scientist? Paleogeneticist. And yes, youth is the time to be reckless and test your boundaries. It's how you learn what's important to you. Rassy Raptor, how slash why would they have a recording of a mating call if it's believed at this point all the dinosaurs were female? Probably got it from Sauna, right? Surely they bred male dinosaurs on Sauna. Maybe they tried to see how they mated. Need a 
quick reminder about how the speakers work? Yes, please. These yes, speakers Luke on the west side too. of the pen yeah, can be set to play a parasaur food call that calls, will attract maybe. hungry dinos. The speakers on the east control the mating sounds that will attract the more uh, amorous dinosaur. The big speakers in the center emit a danger call that will scare the dinos away from it. The main source, as we know, they can make because life finds a way. You literally see it in the movie. Uh, right. If we want to move the dinosaurs forward, we might need to give them a good scare from behind. Oh, we can use the danger call. Good thinking. Danger call. Danger call. Danger call. Dr. Harding? Yeah. I need you to activate the east side speakers, please. East side, okay. <laughs> Jerry Harding stars in Danger Call. Do you think they'll really turn this yeah, place into it. a nature preserve after this? Like Mr. Danger Yoder said, call. that guy was lying through his <laughs> teeth regarding the board. But it did give me a thought. This is a huge setback for InGen. Maybe Hammond's role as CEO isn't as safe as he thinks. Dr. Harding? Yeah? Activate the danger speakers. In the danger pool. That's it. They're out. Good job, Jess. Dr. Harding? Yeah. West side speakers, please. Need a quick reminder about how the speakers work? Yes, please. These speakers on the west side of the pen can be set uh, to play a parasaur wanna... food call that will attract the hungry dinos. The speakers on the east control the mating sounds that will attract the more uh, amorous dinosaur. The big speakers in the center emit a danger call that will scare the dinos away from it. Okay, so we want to bring the main call. Okay, so we want to push this one on. And then this one on. Dr. Harding? Yeah. East side speakers again. So, what happened to your assistant? Let's not talk about that right now. Well, did you work with him long? It doesn't matter. Oh. Listen. He was a wonderful young man, and I am sad. I really am. But if I let that stop my work, 
Then all these animals can I imagine if um, trapped behind the walls that we built? Is it Robin Wright who was in House of Cards and played Princess Buttercup in The Princess Bride? Dr. Harding? I imagine yeah. her. She could have played played uh, Activate the danger speakers. Dr. Sorkin. She was in the new Blade Runner as well. So many puzzles. Finally, it's not really no puzzles. It's just clicking the buttons <laughs> until like at this. Maybe you'll be a behavioral <laughs> you know, you scientist the right someday. One. Maybe I will. There's not so much of a challenge. Ah, this is why she was elected to be the lookout. What's wrong with her foot? It's a broken toe. Feel free to have a look. I just have to do one more thing, and then we can leave. Lysine. If the dinosaurs are to have a fighting chance, they'll need the solution to survive. I'm still not sure. Jerry, this is my life's work. These are basically my children. I'm not gonna let these creatures die because some bureaucrat can't stand losing control. They deserve their own lives. Just... That's very dangerous what he's doing. Dr. Sorkin? <laughs> Laura. Um, I would Laura, not. What's life? You'd, you'd have to have that sort of in some sort of harness. Henry Wu you can't just have it like stood out like that. added a gene to the that. dinosaurs that makes them dependent on supplements of an amino acid called lysine. Without their weekly doses, they'll is all a die big off. dangerous animal. Don't tell my dad, but I got a D in chemistry. Then today should be very educational. The solution we were creating at the lab will reverse this scenario, allowing the animals to live out their natural lifespan. We just You're need right. to get it into that the was main kind water of a supply. Okay, that should be easy, right? This is a big responsibility, Jess. I can handle it, Dr. Sorkin. I mean, Laura. Okay, Jess, let's get started. I'm telling you, man, almost made me swear off Chinese food forever. Yeah, right. I've never seen you refuse an egg roll. Ever. I said almost. Besides, my date was hot. You remember? The girl with the blonde hair, uh, red scarf, uh, what, what was her name? I don't keep track. Oh, you remember her. She was the one that was wearing the... Hold on. You hear that? Go, go, go! <laughs> Chopper down right now, or I swear I will shoot you. Oh, that's real smart. If I'm going down, you're going down with me, sweetheart. Get me. Oscar, get over here. I'll pull you in. Oh, God, he's gonna fall. <laughs> Come on, man. That's it. Come on. One more. She's dead when I get in there. Come on, Oscar. Put those giant friggin' arms to work. Get in here. Okay. Done it. Well, you're one stubborn son of a... Hey! <sighs> Problem. You got this. Land this thing now. Not gonna happen.
<laughs> I did not expect that. Oh my god. Just stabbed him right in the heart. So it's double right, okay. Steven Seagal on the chopper. <laughs> I'm the chef. This water into the main supply I'm and we'll be done. Cook. Yeah, I know that British Tyrannosaur. I know what you're talking about. That's it, Jess. We did it. <laughs> Jess, I'm come just up the here. Cook. I want you to see this. <laughs> Such a funny this video. This is how nature intended these animals to exist. Nina's wow. design reminds me of Vasquez from it. Aliens. Time to really appreciate yeah. It. Reminds me a little bit of um Name the, the woman from Predator as well. Girl, take it easy. What's wrong with that one? Oh no. The monsters. a few good moves, huh? You are lucky to be alive, Jerry. I've never seen anyone outrun a Velociraptor before. Where did they come from? What are they doing out here? Must have escaped from the quarantine pen somehow. Raptors are highly intelligent. They'll find a way up here if we give them enough time. Yeah, these yeah. raptors were it's transferred over. from Sauna to New Glass at the last here. minute. Right Is that it? There we go. All right, chapter two done. I think I will save it there. Pretty good. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to continue with this tonight, but I think I'll finish it there, guys. I quit, and then, yes. 
Now let me just load it up one more time, just to make sure my save's okay. Yeah, sorry guys, it's uh, I've had a long day of work and uh, feeling a bit tired. It is uh, one o'clock in the morning right now. Let me just see. Cruder, cavalry, the depths. Yep, there we go. Cool. Uh, British Tyrannosaur says, when's the next stream? Um, I'll probably be streaming later this week, maybe even tomorrow. Um, probably will be Saturday. Uh, I've got a good night Saturday to live stream. Um, yeah, just look out for it because I'm just going to be doing it now. Now the Christmas period is over. Um, I'll get to live stream a lot more. So, Lewis Brewer asks, do you still live with your parents or not? No, no, no. <laughs> I live on, uh, you know, with my wife. Uh, gonna play some Battlefront 2, enjoy that, Hardcore Jed. Hope that's the PlayStation 2 version. <laughs> Small farms, hey Jack, what's the happening? Happy hats. Well, I'm about to go, I'm afraid, so... Yeah, anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed that video. Uh, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't and uh, yeah and all that jazz I'll uh, catch you on the next stream <laughs> no he's not <laughs> and on that note Lewis good night guys